Hello everyone, Cryo Dog here. Uh, doing a video of uh, the installation of my Patriot uh, Wireless 11 802.11 BGN um, USB adapter. So I'm going to put this in my Mac Mini, and um, hopefully it installs well because my current Wi-Fi. Uh, connection through the built-in Wi-Fi adapter is not very uh, stable so hoping I can get a big improvement so the first thing I'm going to do is remove one of my USB cords here that one goes to my MIDI keyboard which I can plug up somewhere else I'm not using it right now anyway. So I'm going to install it. Okay, I just installed the Wi Fi card. Um, nothing really happening on the screen. So let's see what happens when we go to Wi Fi. Open network preferences and okay. Wi Fi connected. I guess that's my phone. Okay, so I went to PatriotMemory.com and I went to Products and then I did a search or browsed through the website and found the drivers for the wireless and USB adapter for the 300 megabit um, adapter I have. So I've downloaded the drivers. And they are still installing. And it looks like it's done. So let's launch that. Uh, this application cannot be found. That's very common for this Mac. Let's try it again. And it did something. Let's minimize. Wireless in, so I guess this is the contents. Uh, let's see if I can. No, it's the downloads folder. Let's see. Okay, so after you download the drivers, I had to do a little searching, but basically, you uh. For the downloads, you, un you uncompress the uh, zip file, it creates a wireless in folder. You go in there and go down to Mac. And then you want to choose the Realtek most recent driver, which is for Mac OS 10.6, which is what would work for me. Then it creates another folder. With the drivers in there, and then you just launch the installer um, application, which is what I have on the screen here. So, let's see what happens. Click continue. There's some warranty information. Okay, just giving some directions on removing an old driver if you have one. I don't. So let's go to continue. Go through English. <clears throat> I 
we shall agree. Okay, 3.5 megabytes, no big deal. Okay, password has been entered. It's just saying when it's finished installing, we will need to restart the, your computer. Let's install. Mm-hmm. Okay, less than a minute. We shall see. Software was successful. Okay, let's restart. Okay, so after uh, rebooting it came up with some kind of screen with text I've never seen before. Then it quickly flashed away, and then it gave me a message saying my computer encountered a problem while restarting. Please press a key or wait to continue restarting. So I'm waiting to see what it's going to do now. There's that text again. Evidently it did not like the drivers. So, what to do, what to do. There's the other message. So let's press a key. So I'm thinking I mean this one may not work for me. Which means I shall be uninstalling. Somehow. Okay, well, um thanks for watching. <laughs> Wish it would have went better. But it seems to be going in a loop now, so more work to do. Great.